Scoop, it's YouTube, and you already know what's going on. One thing you need to know about loyalty, look here, everybody's loyal. A lot of people say these hoes ain't loyal, women ain't loyal, men ain't loyal, people ain't loyal, friends ain't loyal, family ain't loyal. Everybody talk about this loyalty, trust, loyalty, trust. One thing you need to really learn about this shit, everybody's loyal. If they're not loyal to you, if they're not loyal to you, they don't love you. They loyal to the people they love, but they're not loyal to the people that they don't give a shit about. At the end of the day, people that they, whatever you really love, whatever you care about, whatever you focus on, whatever it is, that's what exactly what you loyal to. If you love it, you're going to be loyal to it. You're going to stay committed to it. You're not going to give up on it. You're going to stay at it. You're going to stay in consistently. But if you're not loyal to it, you're going to stop fucking with it. You're going to leave it alone. And people say other people ain't loyal. It ain't that they loyal. They're not loyal to you because they don't love you. Me, I'm the type of person, hey, I work out. You know why? Because I love it. Therefore, I love it. I'm going to stay committed to it. Therefore, that's loyalty. That's, I fight for it every day. That's what I strive for. I look forward to working out because it's a part of me. That's loyalty. I'm not going to give up on it. I might get pissed off at it. I might get tired some days. But at the end of the day, I'm taking my ass right back to it. Because you know why? I love it. That's loyalty. I have a fiance, children. I have a family. And you know what? I do anything for them. And don't nothing come before them but God. At the end of the day, that's loyalty. I love it. I'm going to come back to it. I'm going to stay with it. I stay at them. I stay consistent with them. I love them unconditionally. They are my family. They are a part of me. That is loyalty. If you play the Nintendo, if you play the Xbox 360, the PlayStation, yeah, I said Nintendo because that's when I was born in the 80s when Nintendo came out. So, yeah, I'm old. So, that's what I came up with, Nintendo. I don't play all this PlayStation, all this gibberish, all this yin-yang. I used to, but I don't do it no more. But if you love playing a game, you loyal to that game. If you love eating, you loyal to that food. If you love whatever you love to do, think about what you love to do. If you love to read the Bible, you loyal to the good Lord. There ain't nothing wrong with that. If you pray every day, you loyal to Him. Whatever you love, whatever you think about, whatever you do every day on a daily basis, that's exactly what you you loyal to you ain't gonna do nothing that you're not loyal to straight up i don't care what it is it don't matter what it is hell if you watch porno you loyal to that hell if you if you cut hair you're loyal to it you're loyal to the game if that's what you do you're loyal to the game ain't no wrong with it because that's your craft if you cook you loyal to the game you know what i mean some people are, i don't care what you do people out here selling dope if they do it consistently that's what they loyal to if somebody tell on your ass, that's not loyalty. If somebody talking bad about you, but not to you, that's not loyalty. Bitch, they want to go on a diet. You can't go on a diet if you're loyal to McDonald's. If you think about a Big Mac all the time, and you're going to take your ass down there, you're going to get like six Big Macs and a chocolate shake. It's not going to mean that you're not going to have bad times. You're going to have ups and downs. That's what the loyalty, that's all a part of the shit. See if you're going to stick with them through the good and the bad, through the happy and the sad. And if you still there, now that's loyalty. Unconditional, down for whatever, ride or die until the fucking end. That don't mean that if you're in a relationship that people ain't gonna try to holler at you. That don't mean that if you're in the game or if you're trying to make some money, or if you're trying to run a business, another opportunity ain't gonna slip up to test your loyalty. That don't mean none of that shit. What I'm saying is, when it come to test you, it trying it really it all boils down to how loyal you really are. It ain't about the situations that come to you. What do you love? What do you care about? So are you ready to sacrifice? Do you love what you say you love or are you just talking this shit? Because at the end of the day, it's going to be a time and a place and that time is going to come that everything is going to get tested. Do you really love that person? Do you really love this business? Do you really love this job? Do you really love what you love to do? Because at the end of the day, opportunity is going to come to test your loyalty. Everything is going to come to test your loyalty, test your strength to see if you're really down for that person, if you're really down for what you're trying to believe in, if you're ready to stay with it and stay at it, is you ready to die for it, is you ready to keep going? Going, what you gonna do? The loyalty is not in the situation. The loyalty is on that person. So if the loyalty is not there, the love is not there. Loyalty is a blessing and it's a gift. And every blessing and every gift involves a test. Just like a lot of people walk around claiming that they're a beast because they work out. Walk around like they're carrying two fucking suitcases. Ain't big or nothing. But at the end of the day, they want to say that they're a beast. How you gonna be a beast when it's time to when it's time to do beast shit? You ain't ready to do it. You're not a beast. Ain't no difference in loyalty. People up there talking about they loyal or they looking for love or they wanna be loyal to their partners or their homies or their family, whatever the fuck they trying to do. Everybody trying to be loyal, but at the end of the day, when it's time to be loyal, when that test comes, are you really loyal? Are you really in love with that person? Are you really cool with your partners? Are you ready to roll with your people? Whatever you're trying to do, and I ain't talking about no gang banging shit nothing like that. Are they, are those people really your friends? Are they really your true family? Cause I'm gonna let you know right now family just don't mean that you relate to a family can be on the outside it don't matter who it is but if you love that person if y'all got a bond if you ride for that person if it's through thick and thin through the storm and weather whatever the fuck ever that's loyalty because i'm gonna let you know right now you loyal to something i don't know what it is think about it 
What do you do every day? What do you love every day? What do you think about? What do you work on? And it's every day. And if it's not every day, it might be for some years. It might be for some months. And you might slow down, but you stay consistent with it. You're staying at it. Whatever, it, whatever that is, that's what you're loyal to. It's just like people talk about relationships and shit like that. At the end of the day, if a person is loyal, they, they just, they, 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 they loyal. Don't get me wrong, they loyal. Oh, yeah. But they're just not loyal to you. Why? They don't love you. They love something that they loyal to. It don't have to be another person or shit like that. Yeah, it might be a drug. It might be shit. might be food. It might be hell. Shopping. It might be money. It don't matter. But whatever it is and it's not true, that's what the problem is. What do they do all the time? What do they think about all the time? What do they talk about all the time? What do they focus on all the time? That's where the loyalty lies. Okay, now can you be loyal to more than one thing? Yes. At the end of the day, yes, you can. But the only reason I bring up relationships and talk about that because it's like the only reason that I talk about that because that's the reason, that's the only concept people can get because the first thing you say, when, as soon as you say something about loyalty, they want to go right to some damn relationship. It's more than relationships. You can be loyal to God. You can be loyal to whatever you, your business, okay? At the end of the day, you can be loyal to all that. Me, I'm loyal to God because I talk to him every day. Jesus is my king. God is my father. I talk to him every day. I thank him. Whether good, bad, happy, or sad, I'm going to talk to him. I'm going to tell him what's on my mind. I talk to my fiance, my wife, every day. Every day. I'm loyal to her. And then, the children. Okay? They are my family. It's a must that I protect them and do what I have to do for them. Because there's love and there's loyalty. Everything boils down to the next generation. Those are the children. Now, the workouts. I'm going to get my ass up in the morning. I don't give a damn how I feel. And if I don't do the workout in the morning, you bet your ass that I'm going to do it in the evening. Because at the end of the day, that's loyalty. I like to do it. That's what I love. I love my family. I love God. At the end of the day, I love all three. I like grilling. I like cooking. I love that. So I'm loyal to it. I love it. I think about it. I think about how to remaster, how to recook, and how to redo things all the time. Because I'm loyal to it. It's what I love. I might not like it all the time. I might hate it. I, sometimes I might want to quit and stuff like that. But I think about it and I go back to it every time. There's loyalty because I love it. How can I forget about y'all? YouTube. I think about y'all all the time. I always want to talk to y'all. I love y'all too. Y'all pay attention to me. I pay attention to y'all. There's loyalty. I'm thinking about y'all day and night. What am I going to tell my people? How y'all doing today? How can I brighten y'all day? How can I put y'all on the right track? How can we help each other? Because at the end of the day, I'm not only talking to y'all, I got to listen to my own video sometimes. I got to pay attention to me. We all human. We all have emotions and feelings and we all got struggles. We all got a journey, baby. And we're going to get this shit right and we're going to get it together.